Hi all, welcome to my channel. Today we are um, planning to give uh, the part 5 of fabric.js. So uh, the last uh, part, part 4, we already have seen how to add an image to our canvas, right? And uh, moreover, uh, we have seen how to uh, set height, how to set width, and how to rotate using uh, methods basically so today what we are going to do is um, basically uh, we will uh, we will uh, see how to animate uh, image how to animate image basically in fabric using fabric.js it's very easy to animate images we have to use uh, animate method, just animate method. Now let us see how to code it. Okay, here, uh, let me remove this uh, rotate. I don't really need this. So uh, let me make uh, the canvas a little bit bigger, 800 uh, and uh, 700 height. Okay, fine. Now what I'm going to do is img dot animate okay the first param basically we have to give the position type where we have to make the where we have to apply the animation effect left or right whether it's uh, to anchor it so that position type we have to specify uh, for example i give left here okay and the second param we have to give the new value to that uh, position type for example i would like to move 500 pixel uh, from the current uh, position left from left to 500 pixel right it has to move okay so and the third uh, param basically uh, what we are going to do is we will apply an on change event I will explain you why we need that let me uh, create this first okay I will give a on change event on change event <coughs> what will happen on every uh, changes happen to the frame it has to re-render the canvas so we know when we um, let me let me write that so you will uh, get to know uh, fabric dot canvas dot render all dot um, byte then canvas okay so what we are going to do is that when the animation effect, uh, when the animation effect go to uh, that frame, each frame of uh, each frame of that object, the canvas should re-render. Otherwise, that effect effect won't be visible. It won't uh, appear properly. Otherwise, um, you know, it's an uh, it's a, it's a uh, speciality of fabric torches. Whenever we uh, give any effects, we should re-render. Otherwise, that effect we won't be able to see. It would be still at the uh, beginning position. So that's why I use render all to uh, re-render the canvas. Okay, now let us see uh, how it look like. Okay, let us open. Yeah, what will happen here? yes see it's 500 pixel it moved from the left to uh, 500 pixel right so let us try to apply a few more uh, a few more properties uh, to our third parameter for example it moved faster right let's make it a little bit slower by applying a duration kind of 3000 i will give now what will happen we will see it will be a little more slow see the image is moving very uh, slow right and you can give 3000 5000 10000 20000 depends on your requirement uh, you can change let me adding applying animation to image in canvas right okay fine so that's how we uh, does that and one more thing we can apply these uh, attribute uh, attribute changes to more than one attribute at a time for example i will show you let me copy this and see uh, let's apply this to another one attribute uh, say ankle ankle okay 
angle uh, should be changed uh, angle should be in degree right let me give 120 degree angle 120 degree should be uh, changed right and on change the same effect should be there and duration also same so let us see now what would be the effect we can see okay the change right the change so these are the properties we give and we can give enormous properties available uh, to this image actually one more what i can try is like one second easing there is a property called the easing that is fabric uh, dot util dot ease dot ease out bounds you have to keep see how it uh, bounds back basically yeah once it reach here now it bounces back right that bounce back is uh, applied by this uh, easing effect actually so uh, that's and you can you can uh, you can uh, try the fabric.js documentation you will get enormous examples and enormous properties and methods available over there you can try all you can play with all the available uh, reference this fabric.js documentation so uh, these are the main stuff now we learn how to apply animation effect to images in uh, using fabric.js it's very simple we just have to apply animate the first uh, param should be the position type and second should be the new value to that uh, position and third param mainly on change even we give to make sure that the canvas is rendering re-rendering on every uh, frame uh, animation changes and duration everything okay so that's all about it here so hope you enjoyed this video and uh, you can click uh, you can like subscribe and press bell icon for more notification please uh, leave a comment uh, for more videos um, and um, we will see in next video thank you